As a, a young boy, I was very good at piano. A prodigy, they called me. My mother was always very supportive of me, maybe more so than I was of myself. She thought one day I would change the world with my talents. I suppose all prodigies are told that at one point or another, and well, that put a lot of pressure on me. It still does, as a matter of fact. My father, on the other hand, wanted me to play football for UC Berkeley like he did when he was in college. When my mother refused to let me, dad left and I haven't seen him since. Look at the Football. way he's built. Piano. That boy's a born linebacker. Talent is linebacker. Talented. Why can't you just see that? Talent. He's a boy. He should be playing piano. sports, not the piano. Prodigy. You just want Legacy. to fulfill the dream. College. You couldn't. Oh, how dare you! My biggest supporter drove her greatest hindrance out of the house and, well, out of our lives, too. Tell me about the music. The music? Well, it was all I had after Dad left. It was there for me when I got home from school, or when I couldn't sleep, or whenever I felt alone. Of course, my mother still supported it, and... Okay, so when I say supported, I should clarify, she pushed it on me, enough that I honestly didn't want to play anymore. My stress relief was simultaneously my stressor. There, there was just too much pressure, it, it took the magic out of it. The reason I've always been good at piano is, is somewhat hard to explain. I still can't read music, but I can feel the way it should be. It, this will probably sound stereotypical, but it's just that the music spoke to me. It still does, in fact. Did, did I say that earlier? You said matter of fact. Oh well, anyway. I never had proper lessons. The keys just... they made sense to me. Suddenly the black and white of the keyboard shows in full color. I can read the music of the universe. It really is like magic, the power my fingertips have. The way the music feels in every note. That magic is what keeps me playing, though it's... Even though it's had such a negative effect on my life, it, it, it's my favorite necessary evil. That's a beautiful way to describe it. You see, Mom always thought that I could change the world to seven notes, you know? It, it's a lot of pressure to put on someone from such a young age. I've always had talent, and at the very least, Mom made sure I knew it. After Dad left, she changed a bit. I think she knew it was her fault he left, and she never really came back from that. Do you know where she is now? As far as I know, still looking for Dad. Could you explain that a little more? Well, he left when I was 13, and she stuck around until she thought I could take care of myself, say, at 17. I think to her, waiting a couple years was enough justification for leaving anyway. You know what's interesting? After Mom left, you'd think I would step back from the keys, but the opposite happened. My oldest pastime was now allowed to be just that. <laughs> I wasn't pushed to be the best, I could just be. I suppose I should thank her for allowing me that in a way. My mom thought I could change the world with music, and my dad couldn't have cared less. What about you? What do you mean? Do you think you made a difference? 